welcome back. We are still downtown at the TNP Depot, and as you can kind of see behind us, we are having a big party, and you can still come and join us. We'll be here until 6 o'clock, but we've got another guest that we'd like to introduce. And since 1993, the young audiences of Abilene has provided after-school arts education for elementary students, sparking their interest in theater arts, visual arts, dance, and so much more. Well, I tell you what, I'm excited about this. I have two guests with me, Laura King and Laura Morales. And as a parent, I think this is such a great program because uh, when my kids were little, obviously they get uh, into sports very you know, at a very young age, but sometimes the arts are neglected. Yes, sometimes they are. They're able to, with our program, the students are able to have these art programs. We have an after school program, and um, we have theater, visual arts, which is what Laurela teaches, and um, we have dance as well. And so some of the kiddos who, who aren't really interested in, in the other side of the sports and all of that, or even some children who don't have the opportunity to be able to participate in those types of things, um, can, can sign up for these classes for free. I think it's very important for children to find where they fit and find where their giftings are. And Laurel, I bet you get a chance to get some very rewarding moments when these youngsters uh, get into your uh, field. Absolutely. I really love seeing the spark of excitement that really lights up in kiddos' eyes whenever they get to try a new um, style of art or learn about something and connect um, art history to their own personal life experience. It's a really great, tremendous honor to be in this community and to be able to serve my youngest neighbors in this way. I really appreciate it. And Laura, I think the uh, Building a self-confidence at, at a young age is important, and seeing the sense of accomplishment in, in this, in your activities, uh, is a great uh, thing for these young kiddos. Yes, it is, and um, if you kind of, you know, there's a table back here behind us, and it has a lot of our students' visual art that Laurela works, and so some of our kids are going to be here tonight, and to see their artwork on display, and to be pr proud of what they're doing, and to know that they accomplished something wonderful, and it was their own and their creativity. And I know, Laurela, you're not necessarily in this, but a part Part of this is the big showcase. Talk about the showcase for the parents that they get a chance to see the uh, the fruits of their children's labors. Absolutely. So the showcase is a really wonderful culmination of what young audiences gives to our kiddos. Um, that they're able to present what they've been creating and really engage and uh, just really be proud and stand as artists and creatives in this community. And I really hope it gives them the confidence to just be tenacious and face a lot of what life throws at them throughout the years. And there's so many ways and so many levels that you can give. To to this program today on Abilene Gives. I really, I really appreciate what y'all are doing, and I, I, I can't wait to see as these youngsters get older and they look back on some of their first efforts, and they were with you guys in your program. Thank you so much. Thank you. And if you would like to give to any of these local nonprofits, you can find all of that information on our website, BigCountryHomePage.com, and don't forget to give. You still have time if you would like to give.